Oh hi! Thanks for watching my video. Today we are in Disney Dreamlight Valley once again. Because we just had another update and that update just kind of came and went. I didn't even notice it. So I thought today we'd have a little bit of a play around. I have noticed under my collection that we have Nala and Simba now. So I'm assuming they're going to be in one of the worlds in the castle. So we're going to go and find them. And I also have a few active quests. There's the making music one for Stitch, so I need to talk to Scrooge. I found a book near my house that apparently belongs to Minnie and a new quest for Buzz as well. So I'm thinking, before we go to the Dreamlight Castle and see if we can find Nala and Simba, let's just go talk to Minnie about her little book. There you go, there's your, there's your spell book. You're welcome. She's been looking for that everywhere, apparently. She borrowed some books from Merlin because... Ah, oh, she wanted to find out what happened to her. Ah, uh, probably best not to dwell on the past, Minnie. You might uncover things you don't like. So I think she kind of wants to try and figure out if there's a way that she can prevent other villagers from disappearing. So I guess I'll go and talk to Merlin and figure out what it all means. Minnie couldn't possibly do it herself. And also, I'm assuming Scrooge is still in his store. And you know what? I might have a little browse around his store anyway, see if there's anything I like. There's never anything good in here, you know? These flowers are alright, maybe I'll get those. Purple orchids, sure. They'll brighten up my space. And Scrooge, before you go anywhere, making music. The whole village is coming out for the concert. Oh yeah, that was from the last video. He's got the sound equipment ready. So I just have to place that on Dazzle Beach, okay? I'm gonna... Oh, Merlin! Good thing I bumped into you here. I believe I know precisely why you've come to speak to me today. It's Minnie, isn't it? She's gotten herself in quite a jumble. Well, yeah, that daft little cow. She has. He thinks he knows how we can fix this predicament. We'll use the most powerful kind of magic there is. You'll need to speak to some villagers and ask them what they like best about Minnie. Okay, so I've got to talk to Elsa, Anna and Moana. Okay, and then bring you some dream shards. Okay, fine, fine. What have we got up here? Boring bed... Maze already have that. Ah, oh, there's never anything new in this store, is there? I thought maybe there would be some cute little Easter trinkets. Well, let's pop down to the beach. It's all greyed out, I'm guessing, for the concert. And we will place down the sound equipment. There we go, that will do. Oh, look at us all there. I don't know why I'm in the band. Am I singing? Oh, so sweet. So I guess this is Stitch's quest over. Aww. Yeah, we'll tell him his goodness level is so high right now. Oh, he's given me a little spaceship. Okay. Cool. Cool. Oh, Wally's got something over his head. What do, what do I need to talk to Wally about? Oh. These must be like the Easter themed quest. Blooming and blossoming and bunnies on the run. You want me to help gathering flowers. Okay. So I have to craft a pretty flower basket. Okay, what's the other one, though? What's the bunnies on the run? You want me to catch bunnies running in the plaza? Aww. Okay, let's take a look at these um, these quests, then. Let's see. So I can win some eggs. I do already have some eggs. Catch the bunnies. Craft a pretty flower basket for Wally. Oh, right. That seems like quite a cute little experiment. Let's do that. I wonder how many bunnies there are running around. Oh, I think I just saw one. Okay, I've got one. Um, can I craft anything? Can I craft a little bouquet? Pretty flower basket. Oh, I already have everything I need for the flower basket. Okay, cool. That is very pretty. Very spring. Okay. Oh, there are five bunnies. Right, okay. Keep my eyes peeled then. Oh, I think I see... Oh no, that was a butterfly. Lots of April showers today. Oh, I got another bunny. It's hard not to confuse them with the butterflies or the squirrels. Get some raspberries. Oh, I see another bunny over there. Oh, fuck's sake, this bloody night thorn's getting in the way. Okay, bunny number three. Two more to go. Oh, there's another one. Oh, Moana, I need to talk to you about Hello. Minnie. What do you like about Minnie the mouse? Her strength of heart. Oh, what a soppy answer. <laughs> okay, thanks, Moana. Oh, I see a bunny. There we go. Okay, one more. Where are you, bunny? Oh, Elsa, I need to talk to you as well, actually. What do you think of Minnie the Mouse? Something really special and unique. She gives wonderful advice. Oh, that's nice. Okay, perfect. Oh, is that another bunny? Yes. 
Oh, I got it. Okay, I've got the five bunnies. I've got the bouquet of flowers. Oh, these, those were pretty easy quests. Where's Wally? Down by his house? Okay. I like that. I like getting themed quests. I hope we get themed quests like that for Halloween. Okay, blooming and blossoming. There's your bouquet of flowers. You treasure that, Wally. And then also bunnies on the run. Okay, sweet. We've got our little Easter quests done. Uh, I also need to talk to Anna for Minnie and then craft some dream shards. Where is Anna? Is she at her house? Yeah, okay. We'll stop by. We'll pop in. Say hello. Oh, she's hiding behind her statue. I have something strange and possibly magical to ask you about, so don't ask too many follow-up questions. Okay. Just tell me what you like best about Minnie. Oh, it's how she always makes me smile. A bit of a cop-out, but okay. So kind and so funny. Okay, perfect, perfect. So basically, Minnie, she just sort of needed a bit of an ego boost, did she? Alright, fair enough. We all need a little bit of gassing up sometimes. There you go, Minnie. Here are all of the compliments. Oh no, I needed the dream shards, didn't I? I think I need three more dream shards. Hopefully I've got everything I need for it. Oh, I think, okay. Where do I keep them? They're in one of these boxes somewhere. Oh, here we go. 56 dream shards. So many. Alright, Minnie, I've got a load of compliments for you and dream shards. Do you have everything you'll need for Merlin's spell? Yes, I do. Wait, what do I need to do with it then? Oh, return to Merlin. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Where is Merlin? This village is so overcrowded now. I don't even see Merlin on here, but you know what? I will see Merlin in the Dreamlight Castle. That's assuming that Simba and Nala are in one of these realms. But wherever they are, if they are in one of these realms, I'm pretty sure I have enough Dreamlight to open it. Oh, maybe they're not. Am I just being blind? Oh, here it is. Okay, perfect. 10,000. Okay, great. I can afford that. Let's open the door to the African savannah. Perfect. Started quest, Eyes in the Dark. Okay, but Merlin, first, let me give you these night shards for Minnie. And then do your little hocus pocusy stuff on it. Oh, he's not going to do a spell. He just wanted the dream shards for his own selfish research. He thinks the answer is within friendship. Ah, oh, lame. So I guess all I have to do is just talk to Minnie, gas her up a little bit, just remind her of how many people love her, you know? But until then, let's go have a look in the African savannah. I can already see Simba there trying to catch some fish. And that looks like Nala. That's uh, his mum, right? It's not his girlfriend. I think his girlfriend is Kiara. Looks like they're in a spot of trouble. Grrr. Oh, she's just roaring at me. Nice kitty, stay back. I promise I'll find you some very large catnip and a scratching post if you just keep your distance. <laughs> okay, okay, she can talk, she can talk, and we can understand her. Oh, so those glowing eyes, they're the hyenas. They've been tracking me ever since my mate Simba and I set out from the Pride Lands. Oh, wait, no, I think Nala... Nala is Simba's girlfriend. Kiara's the daughter. So she wants me to block the path of the hyenas so they can't come and bother us. Okay, okay. Okay, so they're going to make a run for it and I have to block their path. Okay. Dig out the dried thorn bushes. Get myself some sand while I'm here. And some seeds. There's some real tense music going on right now. But enough time for me to open a magical chest for myself. I think that's going to be an outfit. There's no need to rush. I see another digging spot right there. Something for me inside? I think I'm collecting beetles? Gross. Plant the seeds in the holes near the ledge in the dried out oasis, then water them until they grow. Okay, fine, whatever. What kind of wood am I getting here? This doesn't look like normal wood. What wood is it? Colourful bug? Oh, maybe it is just soft wood. It looks a different colour. What did I get in my clothing bag? Oh, cool. Colourful giraffe shirt. Very nice. Oh, these are the holes. Okay, fine. So this is how I'm blocking their path. I'm just going to plant some night thorns so they can't get past. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, so I guess they're just going to grow and then... Yeah, there we go. Okay, so the hyenas won't be able to get through them. Oh, well, Nala seems pretty happy. Yeah, you're oh, welcome. Hey there. I can't believe that worked. The thorns are too dense for the hyenas to get through. We did it. Well, I, I did it. I mean, if you want to give yourself credit, fine. But it doesn't make you come off that well, Nala. You should stick close to me for a bit. Even without the hyenas, the jungle has its dangers. Uh -huh. I don't know where you fall on the food chain. 
but your teeth and claws aren't very sharp and you look kind of squishy. There's a huge dried stump blocking our way into the jungle. Oh, I think that's where Simba is. Maybe another one of my royal to tools can help remove that. Well, yeah, I'm sure it will. It's pretty simple, actually. I could just dig these stumps up, get myself some wood. And I guess this is going to lead the way to the jungle. Can I collect these mushrooms? No, just for decor purposes. Okay, fine. Ooh, I wonder what that is. It looks just like it's basil. Oh, sugar cane. Oh, this is pretty. I can use it, apparently. Okay, so maybe Nala's going to ask me to do a bit of cooking. Otherwise, it seems a bit pointless, that being there. I don't see Simba, but the good news is I don't see anything around here that would want to eat you either. Oh, good. That's a relief. I'll look around here. Why don't you look for Simba on the other side of the river? Okay, so Nala's going to look around here, and then I just have to look at the other side of the river. How do I get to the other side? Lower the log near the waterfall. I wonder if using my... I wonder if I can just dig over here then. Yeah, okay, this is this is definitely going to work. There we go. Job done. Collect some of these jungle stones. All right. I feel like Simba's probably going to be around here somewhere. I doubt Nala's going to find him. I wonder what the whole point of that cooking thing was. There's Simba. Hey, buddy. All right, calm it down. He's, oh, Simba's been looking all over the jungle for Nala. She's waiting on the other side of the river. Ah. Okay, let's go see Nala. She's near the entrance to the jungle. I'm guessing they're going to ask me to cook them a meal. Watch their joyous reunion. Aww. Oh, look at them together again. Nala, am I glad to see you? I'm not going to read all of their dialogue because I expect it'll be really boring. They won't say anything funny. They do look so happy to see each other, though. How sweet. Oh, here we go. I'm so hungry I could eat a whole zebra. Yeah, they're starting to talk about getting hungry now, so obviously I'll be using the pot. Oh, he's going to ask me to cook the bugs. She said, you better not be thinking what I think you're thinking, and he was like, trust me, it will be slimy and delicious. We didn't get to explore much. I want to do something special with her, show her what life was like for me to moan and Pumba. Bugs and grubs, okay, great. There are some really slimy bugs that you can fish out of the river around here. And there are some colourful bugs just outside the jungle in the dried out oasis. Okay, I think I found the colourful bugs already. Oh, there are two more colourful bugs that I need. And three in the river. Okay, well, the, the, this is going to be easy, so I'll get the slimy bugs. Okay, we got one. You just caught a slimy bug. Okay, and then we got these two over here. Slimer number two. Okay, three slimy bugs. Done. And then I guess I have to go back around here. Oh, it's going to be this hole right here, isn't it? Okay, perfect. All right, Simba, I've got your bugs. Great job, but I think this meal could use more crunch. There are some red bugs over where you found me earlier. You'll have to dig up the stumps, so be careful. Oh, okay, fine, fine. Remove the stumps deeper in the jungle. These ones? Is this what he means? Oh, yeah, it must be. Oh shit, they are running quite fast though. Oh, come here, you fuckers. I wonder if I'll get any more if I... Oh, no. Oh, I do need a bit of food though. Maybe we'll have a couple of lemons. Oh, we can have a salmon. One more of these slippery little fucks. Okay, cool. Cook three bug platters. Oh, what? Have I got to have one? Uh, no, that's okay. I'll just do the two. Is there like a specific order that they have to be cooked in? I mean, there's no um, recipe, so I'm going to assume it's going to be one of these and two of these each. So we'll do two colourful bugs, two red bugs, and then one slimy bug. That should be a bug platter. Okay, perfect. Five stars for that. Ugh, gross. Okay, cool. Okay, three bug platters. Okay, give these a try. Tell me what you think. I did my best. So these are the grubs that Simba loves so much. They look kind of tasty. Uh-oh, I think a few more hyenas have come to join the party. Mm. If only we had a herd of lions to fight them off. We just need to make it sound like we have a hundred lions in this jungle. Okay, so I guess I'm going to go back to the village and find something to amplify their voices, I guess. Okay, well, I'm sure Scrooge can help. Okay, so I need to speak to Scrooge. Oh, Minnie's right there. I can go and quickly chat to her. Hold up, Minnie. Hold up. Ditch wants coconut cake and coffee! 
<laughs> I tried to talk to Minnie on a deep level about how her friends like her, and I can hear Stitch screaming in the background, Stitch want coconut cake and coffee! <laughs> Ah, oh, sorry, Minnie. I can only give you a little bit of my attention because you're not as funny as Stitch. Okay, I think I think Minnie's got the message from this. Basically, the best way to prevent people from disappearing is to just constantly remind them of how wonderful they are and that they are loved. What a lovely message. Oh, she's gave me a load of clay and some money as a thank you for building her that clock tower that all that time ago. I can't remember how long ago it was now. Good day to you. Okay, I need uh, help with Eyes in the Dark. Ooh. I hope Scrooge isn't going to be a dick about this. I hope he's not going to be like, Oh, I know what you need, but first, something for me. I hope he's not going to be an asshole. It's in rough shape, but with a few repairs, it ought to do the trick. Okay, great, great. I'll do the repairs and take this back to Nala. Okay, he, so he's just giving it to me for free. All right, that's good. That You're starting to redeem yourself now, Scrooge. Um, do I actually need anything to repair it though? Or is it just as simple as going to the crafting table? Maybe, I guess it will tell me if I need anything, like iron ingots or something. Oh yeah, I did need stuff, but I've already got it all. Okay, perfect. Oh, great. Oh, that was handy. In between now and the next video though, I'm gonna have to try and dedicate some time to gathering up my resources again, because I've been burning through these basically out of iron ingots now but that's okay because I still need to build a relationship with Olaf the chick from Encanto and now Nala and Simba so between now and the next episode I can at least use them all to increase our friendship and then get resources and then in the next video we'll just do all the friendship quests right Nala I got you don't run away from me bitch hey oh I got you a sound system okay <laughs> So I guess they're putting it to the test. Oh yeah, that is gonna make those hyenas shit themselves. You've definitely made me curious about this place you've come from. Yes! Yeah, you should you should come. Okay, so they've agreed to come. I just Thank need to you. go and set up a little home for them, and I know exactly where to put them next to their best friend, Scar. Scar's gonna have to learn to share his land. I expect he will not be very happy. Oh no, that's his fucking problem. I think what I might do is um, I might put Simba and Nala on the other side of the river and then that way they can keep their rivalry going. So Scar's territory is the right side, Simba's territory is the left. Yeah, so this side we'll give to Nala and Simba. I just need to find a space that would be good for them. Okay, Pride Rock is pretty big it turns out, okay. What if I get rid of those little bones over here? Oh, there are some more Easter eggs there. I have so many Easter eggs now. I think I can plant them as well. Okay, perfect. We've got space for Pride Rock. It's gonna cost more Dreamlight, I'm sure. 15,000 coins. Ah. Oh. Okay, so that's Nala and Simba's home. Welcome, Nala. What about Simba? Is he not coming? Okay, Nala's here. What about Simba? Ah, oh, sweet. I'll go talk to him for now, you just enjoy the villa. Okay, so I have to go back and, I guess, convince Simba that it's a good idea to come here. Okay, fine. I wonder if this is going to be one of those Elsa and Anna situations where I have a entirely different quest now to get, um, to get Simba to come back. Alright Simba, what's the deal? Why aren't you coming- why didn't you come back with Nala? Everything that happened with the hyenas, it brought back a lot of memories and now I'm feeling a little lost. Oh, he misses his dad. Oh, well, he is dead, so sorry. Follow Simba deeper into the jungle. Okay. You know I can't bring people back from the dead, don't you, Simba? I can't bring back Mufasa. Sorry about that, but... When I was young, my father told me that the great king of the past looked down on us from the stars. If I could see them, I'd know what to do, but there are too many clouds. Does he want, like, a telescope or something? Mm. I'll go talk to Merlin and see if he might know what's Bye. going on. Yeah, I wonder if Merlin will be like, oh, go and talk to Wally. He'll let you borrow his telescope. Okay, where is Merlin? Where's old wizard sleeve? Oh, okay, he's down by Peaceful Meadow. Merlin, hold up, hold up, hold up. Simba won't come back unless I help him see the stars. The realms are tied to their memories. Oh, I wonder if I have to find a memory 
You'll have to start by creating some sort of object to channel the spell, something that holds meaning to Simba. Something from his past, I guess. Point the walking stick towards the clouds. Okay, well I've got all the stuff I need except purified night shards. I don't even know if I've got the stuff I need to make purified night shards though. Oh, by the way, do you like my uh, fairground? Got some of the rides. Thought it might bring a little bit of uh, colour to the valley, you know. Got my teacups. Right, let's go and see what I've got. I don't know if I've got in I've got the ingredients to make purified night shards though. That's what I'm worried about. Let's see. Okay, I do not have enough night shards to make a purified night shard, but I do have onyx and it looks like I've got a lot of it too. So what if I make 21 night shards? Will that be enough? Um okay, purified night shard. He said three, didn't he? I think. I think it was three night shot. Okay, perfect. Rafiki's walking stick. All right, sweet. I think I've done it. Return to the Lion King realm. Okay, so this should work. All right, let's go. You know who I really want to see an appearance by? Snow White. When they bring in Snow White. Okay, I've got your little stick. So I guess we'll do place Rafiki's walking stick on the stone mound. What, this thing right here? Yeah, okay. Oh, are the clouds disappearing? Are we finally going to see the stars? The little lion in the sky? Oh, look at that. Beautiful. And Simba's so happy, bless him. It worked. The sky's clear. Look at all those stars. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. I, I made that happen. Follow Simba to the dried out oasis. What, have I not done enough to convince him to get... Your girlfriend's there. What are you going to do? Live here by yourself? God damn it. If you stay here, Simba, you're just going to be the king of nobody. Is that what you want? Okay, what now? It used to be a waterhole for the animals in the jungle, but it looks like it's been dried out for quite a while now. It needs some water. If there were plants, that would bring back a lot of the smaller animals, and they would bring it back the bigger animals. It's the circle of life. There's a plant near one of the waterfalls that might have some too. So I guess I followed him all this way only to go back on myself, huh? Okay. I wonder if I... Do I need to dig this? Okay, cool. Getting some seeds. Perfect, perfect. Oh, I think I see something behind here. Okay, perfect. Some more seeds. Anything in this? Probably just wood, right? Yeah, just a bit of wood. Oh, I'm one plant short. And I don't know where it is. Oh, here it is. Okay, perfect. Have all of these Glad seeds. Now we just need to plant them around the oasis. Okay, so I guess I'll just plant them in random spots then. Okay, there you go. There's all, they're all planted. Looks like you planted all the seeds and I'm pretty sure I figured out how to bring the water back. There's a river that used to run through here. It fed the oasis and kept the plants alive, but the river's blocked. Oh, okay. So I just have to use my pickaxe to break the rock blocking the river. Okay. I'm guessing this is where the blockage is. Okay, perfect. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Will you come back to the valley now, instead of having me do the runaround? It looks better already, and this is just the start. Okay, I think he's agreeing. Okay, perfect. I think he's agreeing to come back to the valley now. All right, Simba, follow me. I already have your little house placed. Welcome, Simba. All right, perfect. All right, well, Simba is now in the valley. I think it's just Buzz's quest we've got outstanding. Look at all these new friends we have. Well, on that note, I think I'm going to end this video here. And then in the next video, which I'll probably wait a little while, maybe in a few weeks before we do the next one, because I want to build up those friendships with all the other fairly new townies or villagers. But yeah, this one will end here. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe, you know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.